100 years of history and civic duty meet the past becomes present. Cemetery maintenance is not a new concept, but this is different. As Brad Underwood shows us in this Local 12 exclusive, volunteers are making sure that African American veterans are not forgotten. On the hillside overlooking Sutton Road, at least 1,400 veterans rest eternally. There's a lot of folks that don't understand the history of this cemetery. History full of men making history. We have about seven confirmed Civil War uh, veterans in the cemetery. One of them, Samuel Robinson, a member of the 54th and 55th Massachusetts Infantry Regiment, a unit made famous by the movie Glory. <laughs> Uh, not many cemeteries can boast having a soldier that served in the uh, 54th Massachusetts. Surrounding men like Robinson, soldiers like Lou Jones of the 10th Cavalry Regiment, a segregated unit, original Buffalo soldiers charging San Juan Hill with Teddy Roosevelt. We have Spanish-American war soldiers buried here, uh, Buffalo soldiers from the 9th and 10th Cavalry and the 24th Infantry Regiment. Todd Mayer believes 98% of the veterans' headstones here are African-American men. Sadly, erosions hid many of the markings, but Mayer and volunteers from the Anthenaeum of Ohio Seminary are preserving the past. They've done almost 400 stones out here. They've been able to straighten them, and uh, they, they work great together as a team. The volunteers have gotten a lot done, but obviously still many more headstones need to be set. The goal, once all of this is done, is to offer walking tours through the cemetery to celebrate these heroes. Mayer is a Desert Storm Army combat veteran, a 30-year man and Purple Heart recipient. He feels a bond with the soldiers here. But protecting this hill is about helping all of the dead and their families. Just this week, a call for help from Virginia. I was able to find his grandmother's grave. She was born a slave in Georgia. Uh, she's buried here, and he was happy as can be that I had a picture of her headstone for him. At Hillcrest Cemetery, Brad Underwood, Local 12 News. If you'd like to help out at the cemetery, we have the information you need at local12.com. Another incredible story there by Brad Underwood. Of course. All right.